Hey guys, I'm Shreya. Welcome back to Mom's World. So in today's video, I will be talking about something very common which we all go through in our day-to-day -day lives and it's nothing but stress. Stress is our body's way of responding to demands. These demands can be at your workplace, your college life, during your exams, during pregnancy, post-delivery and other situations. When we are exhausted and struggling to cope up with these demands, we feel stressed out. A little bit of stress is a must to keep us going. In fact, it can be a motivator. It keeps us alert and active. But beyond a certain point, stress stops being helpful and starts causing major damage to our health, our mood, our relationships and our quality of life. At this point, it's very important to know how to deal with major and minor stress events and when to seek help. Stress during pregnancy Pregnancy is a time of many changes. Your body, emotions, family, everything will be changing. You may happily welcome these changes, but it can also add some new stresses to your life. Feeling stressed out is a common thing during pregnancy because there will be a lot of hormonal changes taking place in your body. When stressed out, you may experience frequent headache, loss of appetite, trouble in sleeping and sometimes even overeat. If it's for a short time, then it's fine. But if it continues for a longer time, then you may have problems like high blood pressure or even heart disease. And this type of stress during pregnancy can cause premature birth or sometimes babies with low birth weight. So what causes stress during pregnancy? It can vary for every woman, but here are some of the common causes. You may be dealing with the discomforts of pregnancy like constipation, morning sickness, frequent headache, backache, being tired all the time, etc. Your hormones are changing which can cause mood to change. Mood swings can make it harder to handle stress. You may have the fear of labor pain or how to take care of your baby. And if you're a working mom-to-be, you may be worried about your job responsibilities and so on. All these things can add stresses to your life. So to help you out, I will be sharing some simple yet effective tips to deal with stress during pregnancy. Tip number one, prepare yourself right from day one. Luckily for us women, pregnancy is a nine month long journey. So make sure that you fully utilize these nine months to prepare yourself physically and mentally. Start everything right from day one. Don't think that you have nine months to go because these nine months will pass in the blink of an eye. Tip number two, Always talk openly about your concerns. During my pregnancy, I had a lot of concerns and I'm sure many women go through this. Talk openly to your doctor or midwife. If you're not comfortable talking to them, you can talk to your mom who has gone through this earlier or your partner or your friends. Sharing your concerns will make you feel a lot, lot better. Tip number three, create a pregnancy journal. Start writing about the minute changes your body goes through each day or each month. This will keep you occupied and you will also cherish this for years to come. You can create your own journal or you can get it from store. Tip number 4. Stop worrying about the future. Don't sit and worry whether you'll be a perfect mom or not. Parenting is something you learn along the way. Every mother has her own unique way of taking care of her baby. If you're still concerned, try spending some time with young babies of your friends or family to know how it really feels like. Number 5. Take a holiday. Going on a holiday is one of the best way to de-stress. Don't worry about your work and commitments because this is your time. So just go relax and pamper yourself. You need not select exotic locations for an holiday. You can go to any place within your budget and ask for your convenience. Tip number 6. Eat well and exercise daily. If you are worried about your to be born baby's health, then first you will have to take care of your own health because a healthy mother will give birth to a healthy baby. Start eating well, maintain a well balanced diet and perform exercises which are safe during pregnancy. This way you can reduce stress and you will also feel better. Tip number 7. Bring back your childhood days. Now that you're grown up does not mean that you can't be a kid again. Watch your favorite childhood cartoons, bring back all your childhood memories. I love cartoons and it is one of the best ways to de-stress. I'm sure many people love it. Buy yourself a coloring book and crayons and start coloring like how we used to do in school. 
Start playing your childhood games, go through your childhood photos and videos and recreate those memories. Also, laughing is one of the best ways to de-stress. Watch a funny movie or a video, sit and chat with friends and family and talk about the funny events that happened in the past and laugh out loud. Tip number 8. Prioritize your life. We humans do not have any superpowers. At times, we all feel a bit overburdened and this is a very common cause for stress. Accept that you cannot do everything at once and start to prioritize your life. Tip number 9. Listen to music. Listening to music is a very good way to de-stress. Whenever you feel lonely or busy with thoughts that disturb you, turn on some light music to distract yourself. Tip number 10. Focus on your body. Focus on your body and the baby that is growing inside you. Keep all your work aside because everything else can wait. Always listen to your body and give yourself enough time because you deserve it the most. Your body is working really hard to nourish the baby that is growing inside you. So you will need enough rest and enough sleep. Always remember one thing, life is busy and sometimes it takes unexpected turns. That does not stop just because you are pregnant. Pregnancy is just a phase of life. So enjoy this phase to the fullest. Capture each and every moment of your pregnancy because trust me later you will miss being pregnant. I hope today's video was helpful to you. If you liked it, do not forget to hit the like button and subscribe. Also for notification, click on the bell icon next to the subscribe button. In my next video, I will share simple tips to deal with stress post delivery. So I'll see you next week. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.